Hi there, this is a short video tutorial on revising collecting like terms in algebra. We're going to do various examples um, to understand what's going on here. So example one. Suppose I had to um, simplify the following. x plus x plus x plus x plus x. What would I do? Well we have how many x's have we got? We've got 1x plus another x is 2x plus another x is 3x plus another x is 4x plus another x is equal to 5x and we're done. Okay, so that's example 1. Example 2. In algebra, any letter is uh, usable, so it doesn't always have to be x's. So say we had, for example, p plus p plus p. How would we simplify this? Well, we have 1p plus 2p's, is, and then plus another p is equal to 3p. Okay, let's try another example. Example 3. Say we had x plus uh, x plus 2x plus 3x. What would we have? Well, we have 1x plus another x is 2x plus another 2x is 4x plus another 3x is equal to 7x. So we would have 7x. And let's do one more example, maybe where we have x's and p's in it together. So example 4, say we have, um, uh, I don't know, 3x plus 2p plus x plus 5p, what would we have? Well, firstly deal with x's. We have 3x and we add another x. Always uh, underline the symbol before um, your variable x. So we have 3x plus another x is equal to 4x. And now let's do the same with p's. We have here 2p's, positive 2p's, and we're going to add another 5p, and we're going to get 7p. So it's going to be plus 7p. And they're the four main examples. We'll do one more example just to deal with uh, subtraction happening. So moving on to another, let's just do an example with subtraction. So example five, let's have a, a large one here. Let's say we had, I don't know, x plus 3p plus 6x, subtract a p, I don't know, subtract 2x, and... So, uh, let's say plus uh, 4p, what would we have? Well, let's deal with x's first. We've got an x here. And we're going to add plus a 6x, so we've got 7x. But then we're going to take away 2x, or subtract 2x. So x plus 6x is 7x. Take away 2x is equal to 5x. So this would be equal to 5x. And with the p's, we've got... A positive p, and we take away a p, so that's going to be 2p, but then we add on a 4p, so we'd have plus 6p. And so we're done for this particular video, a brief revision introduction to collecting like terms. Thank you for watching.